if you're looking for an unforgettable outdoor adventure, look no further than the Glarus Alps. In this video, I'm gonna show you some of the best views and hiking trails that this area has to offer. Hi, my name is Tegan, and in this video, I'm going to take you on a tour of the Glarus Alps. This is one of my favorite places to go hiking because of all the breathtaking views it has to offer. Not only that, but there are also plenty of outdoor adventures waiting for you here as well. So come join me as we explore everything this area has to offer. The Glarus Alps are a breathtaking mountain range in Switzerland that offers stunning views and plenty of outdoor adventures. If you're looking for an amazing travel destination, this is it. The Glarus Alps are located in the canton of Glarus in northeastern Switzerland. The range includes several peaks over 3,000 meters. The landscape is stunning with glaciers, alpine meadows, and plenty of wildlife. The first thing to note is that the Glarus Alps are located in a remote part of Switzerland so getting there can be a bit of a challenge. The best way to reach the region is by car, and we recommend planning your route in advance. If you're coming from Zurich, the drive will take about two and a half hours. If you're coming from Geneva, it will take about four and a half hours. There are also several airports in the area, including Zurich Airport and Friedrich Schaffen Airport. Once you've arrived in the Glarus Alps, there are plenty of activities to keep you busy. Here are some of the best things to do in the area. There are dozens of hiking trails in the Glarus Alps, ranging from easy walks to challenging hikes. Whether you want to explore alpine meadows or climb to the top of a mountain, you'll find the perfect trail for you. The most popular hike in the Glarus Alps is the Panorama Trail, which takes you to the top of Mount Pilatus. From there, you'll enjoy stunning views of Lake Lucerne and the surrounding mountains. If you're looking for a longer adventure, you can hike from Kander Steg to Adelboden, a journey that takes about four days. The Glarus Alps are a popular skiing and snowboarding destination, with several resorts offering slopes for all abilities. If you're looking for a challenge, try tackling the D. The D is the highest peak in the Glarus Alps and offers breathtaking views of the surrounding mountains. The Glarus Alps offer a challenge for even the most experienced skiers and snowboarders. The Glarus Alps are home to a variety of wildlife, including marmots, chamois, and ibex. Keep your eyes peeled while you're hiking, and you might spot one of these amazing creatures. If you're lucky enough to see a marmot, you'll notice that they are large ground squirrels with short tails. They are usually brown or gray and have white patches on their faces. Marmots are found in mountain meadows, and they hibernate in the winter. Chamois are another type of animal that you might see in the Glarus Alps. They are a type of antelope, and they have curved horns. Chamois are reddish brown, and they have a white patch on their throats. These animals live in rocky areas, and they are good climbers. Ibex is a type of wild goat that has long, curved horns. The males have longer horns than the females. Ibex are brown or black, and they have white patches on their throats and rumps. These animals live in mountainous areas, and they are good climbers. If you're interested in seeing some of the wildlife that lives in the Glarus Alps, make sure to go on a hike and keep your eyes peeled. You might just spot a marmot, chamois, or ibex. These animals are amazing to see in their natural habitat. There are several towns in the Glarus Alps, and each one offers a different experience. If you're looking for a small town with plenty of charm, we recommend staying in Mali's. This town is located in the valley, and it's a great base for exploring the surrounding mountains. If you're looking for a larger town with more amenities, we recommend staying in Sargans. This town is located on the border of Switzerland and Liechtenstein, and it's a great base for exploring both countries. The area offers some fantastic hotel accommodations. We recommend checking out the following hotels. The Hotel Pil at Escom is located in the town of Mollies and it offers stunning views of the surrounding mountains. The hotel has a restaurant, bar, and spa. There is also a cable car that goes up to the summit of Pilatus. The Hotel Berghaus is located in the town of Sargans and it offers a variety of amenities, including a spa and an indoor pool. The rooms are spacious and the views of the Glarus Alps are breathtaking. There is also a restaurant on site that serves Swiss and international cuisine. The Hotel Wesharn is located in the town of Kander Steg, and it offers stunning views of the surrounding mountains. The hotel has a restaurant, bar, and terrace. There is also a sauna and massage service available. The Hotel Alpena is located in the town of Adelboden, and it offers a variety of activities, including hiking and skiing. The hotel has a restaurant, bar, and terrace. The rooms are spacious and have a TV. 
no matter where you decide to stay in the Glarus Alps, you're sure to have a fantastic time. This area is full of breathtaking views and outdoor adventures. If you're looking for an amazing and beautiful mountain range to visit, the Glarus Alps are definitely worth considering. With towering peaks, pristine lakes, and lovely villages dotting the landscape, these mountains will take your breath away. Whether you're a seasoned hiker or just looking for a relaxing vacation spot, the Glarus Alps have something for everyone. So what are you waiting for? Plan your trip today.